I am Jean Botazzi, I'm a French caver. Um, I uh, introduced that place because I'm exploring cave in Guizhou for very long ago and my first coming here was 2001. And this place is the first one in this area that was printed into my memory. When I arrived here in 2001, this road was maybe one third of this. It was uh, quite hard to go and the soil was made of mud. The condition, the valley, the shape of the valley, the landscape completely changed. You can see many houses or our modern house with uh, quite comfortable with glass at every window. Before, you had no, no glass at all. That means the wind could go into your home and get out like it, like, like it wants. Um, all were wooden houses. Maybe this kind of farm is already quite improved, improved a lot. This is uh, Gongguan Chiao. Uh, the first time we had to go to Shanghai, we had, we had to stop our car. In fact, this do not exist. All the houses you can see behind did not, were, were not here. But uh, the bridge was still here for 200 years ago. Um, we have to, to imagine uh, the, the village of Gongping in fact, it was on this area and uh, was uh, made of wooden, uh, wooden village. Uh, the muddy road arrived from there and go up to, you can see uh, behind uh, the concrete road. Uh, the, the road was going up very steep and the car was just sliding on right and left. We tried to push it, but no way. Um, now, with the road, people first can uh, also walk in the city, but because of the tourism, they can have local walk. Uh, it can be directly uh, for to receive the tourists, but it can also be to prepare uh, and organize the tourist activity, or just to contribute to build the, to work on the, the, the building of the houses, of the of the of the road and uh, improve uh, improve the the tourist facility. So all the economy of the valley changed, completely changed. This this board is installed by the by the National Geopark. So uh, it it really expresses the, the all, all the process from exploration to development. Currently the total length is over 280 kilometers long. It's the number four, I think, in the world in terms of cave lengths. Then becomes the longest in Asia. The, the cave entrance name is uh, Ho Chodong. It's one of the 72 entrance, entrances of uh, Shuang Hodong. Uh, this one we use for the training course. We give some uh, training um, at first, we give a caving training course for Chinese people who want to learn and practice. Here, we already started some experience uh, about this by some uh, cave tourists that do not need to make any destruction in the cave. I think uh, is an important thing for the future uh, because it's, it's good, it's a win-win. Uh, the environment will win something because it's less destructive for environment and the people, the tourists will win something because instead of just going and see the things, they will come and learn from what they see.